What's up guys, Tony Snuff here, Mini. I am Tony and all of this is Snuff. Thank you so much for coming back to my channel. Skid up off your Pornhub and spank where are you sick bastards. Put away your ding dong, turn off that sexy music, whip out your snuff, and let's get to sniffing it. And I hope you don't got your ding dong in your hand. Before we get going, everybody, stop, pause the video, or don't, just listen to me talk stupid. Get down in the comment sections to let us know what's going on in your nose today. Today we are going to be doing a review on Silver Dollar Boom Cola Snuff. Yep, we are hitting another one of these guys. See if we can actually get some Coca-Cola or Pepsi-Cola or whatever kind of fucking cola you got going on in your nose. And we're going to see if it actually smells kind of like the real deal. I don't know if it does because I haven't used it yet. Um, I'm lying. I used it throughout the day today. Um, and we're going to go ahead and jump right on into it. Um, I'm working on getting all of this light laid out. I only have literally this much table to work with. Um... Whenever we Jen gets here and after a couple months, we're going to move and in, hopefully into a bigger place. Maybe move, maybe not. I don't know. It's up to us whenever she gets here. And then maybe I'll have more room to do these reviews, almost like my last house whenever I had that huge elaborate setup. But as for right now, I, I mean, I got all this and there's actually some behind the curtain there too. So before we get into this, I just want to show everybody my cool new lighter. Um, you could get it on scamstuff.com. It was sent over to me um, by somebody. going to remain anonymous because that's what they asked for. But it's a windproof lighter. And it just clips up like that. And it does not use a flame. It uses a damn thing of electricity. Yeah. Boom, 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 boom. And it's totally windproof. Watch. You cannot blow this thing out. And it lights every single time you touch the button and i'm just gonna grab something to show you all that it actually does light stuff on fire or grab a piece of flash paper because why not um got it from a magic person anyway so look all you do is you stick whatever you want light on fire in there push the button once and it's freaking lit just like that um i actually lit somebody's cigarette with it today at walmart just because it was really funny their lighter wasn't working because it was super windy outside so i was like wait i got you and it sounds like a little taser. I don't know if you can hear it or not. But it's really cool. It has a little purple arc of uh, electricity right there. I haven't touched it like eh, because I don't want it to shock the shit out of me. I don't know if it will or if it'll just burn. I don't think there's like much voltage going through it. I think it's just a very low voltage zero amp electricity that just connects. Um, but I'm not going to fucking try it because I'm not dumb. Anyways... Um, Silver Dollar Cola Snuff. Silver Dollar, just like all of them, comes in this little tap tin where you just rotate the lid and it comes, you get to the hole and you tap it out. Out of the tin. You don't really smell much at all. <laughs> so we'll just go ahead and tap it onto the hand just like that. Boop, boop. Ooh, that's kind of clumpy. I just dusted this table too. All right, so first impressions, I'm getting a lot of clumps out of it, um, but that could have just been because it was exposed to a little bit of humidity um, at some point during packaging delivery because it only comes with a little plastic liner around it. So even in shipping, it's not completely protected from humidity. It's kind of a medium fine grind, medium moisture, boop, as you see right there on the finger. And um, yeah, that's the color and consistency. No, it's almost uh, just the normal average brown like you would find in a toke or other silver dollars. So let's go ahead and put this up in the nose, shall we? <laughs> All right. So the first thing that you notice is it's not like... um. Another cola I've used in the past. I freaking forgot which one it is. Um, but it's not made. It's not mentholated, which is good. I hate getting something that says cola, and there's two or three of them out there where it'll say cola on it, but they make it with a menthol scent to it. That's not cola. I'm sorry. I don't know what kind of cola that you drink that has menthol in it, but that, that's not cola. Um, what I get a little bit of a cola, a, a tiny bit of a sweetness to it, but it mostly just smells like um, just unscented ground tobacco 
almost like tote quit smells with a little bit of sweetness. You get a tiny little tingle, but you don't get any kind of a burn from it. Not much tingle, just a very slight tingle, almost like bubbly, but that goes away instantly. And then what you're left with is just a um, just a ground tobacco smell. Um, that's pretty much it. That's all that you could say about it. The ground tobacco smell, just like any normal ground tobacco smell, only stays in your nose for like two or three minutes. It's nothing special. Um, it's just like a ground tobacco smell. You might as well be getting an unscented product. That's what I've gotten from this. And I have two tins of this, and I've tried the other tin also. And it's actually a newer tin, and it smells the exact same. You know, there's no difference. Um, there's no change in quality, change in scent. It's the exact same thing. It just has that baseline ground tobacco smell to it. Now, you do get your nicotine from it, you know, just a normal average nicotine. So it's not bad. If, you, if you're not looking for a snuff that has much of a smell to it at all, then um, go with Silver Dollar Cola. However, if you're looking for something that smells like cola, then I would suggest just sticking to, like, Tote Coke. That's probably... And that's the best one that I found um, that gets you a little bit of a cola smell at least. But the Silver Dollar Cola, it, it really doesn't it doesn't do it for me. Um, so if you're looking for something with a smell to it, then I would recommend looking in another direction. And this is really weird because I very rarely give a thumbs down to a snuff. Um, but it, it all depends on what you're looking for. Would I suggest somebody that I know that likes like scented snuffs to try this? Absolutely not. I would say, look, go go tote Coke if you're looking for some cola or go with a different brand um, just on the cola. That doesn't speak for all silver dollar scents. Um, that's just for this one right here. Uh, throw that disclaimer out there um, because there are some really good silver dollars out there. However, I mean, no shit. This smells almost like silver dollar original, <laughs> except... For five seconds, you get a little bit of a sweet smell to it. That's pretty much what you're getting with uh, that silver dollar snuff. So, guys, don't forget to leave the comment and what you got going on in your nose today. If you've ever tried silver dollar cola snuff, had the same, or a different opinion than I do, make sure you leave in the comment sections below. I'm always good for um, you know for a reval of something if somebody else gets a different smell. Also, don't forget to let us know what you got going on in your nose. Don't forget to hit me up on Facebook and Snapchat. Facebook.com slash Tony Snuff and Snapchat. Tony Snuff. That's it. And hold on. Hold up. Speaking of Snapchat, I'm sick of just doing this after I record the video and it's going through rendering. So I'm going to do it right now. Yeah, so don't forget to follow me over on Snapchat. Just search Tony Snuff and follow me over on Facebook. Facebook.com slash Tony Snuff. And of course, boom. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, so don't forget to follow me over on Snapchat. Just search Tony. Boom. My story. I told y'all. I always upload whenever I get a new video coming online. So make sure you follow me over there. I always have updates. Remember, next week I'm not going to be doing any reviews because I'm going to be in San Antonio. I'm going to try and do another one over the weekend, but I can't promise anything because I am I have a lot going on with schoolwork, um, military type schoolwork. Um, they're doing apartment inspections, so I got to make sure everything's like spot on. I burped. And uh, so I'm going to try and fit in another review for you guys over the weekend. I still have literally all of these to review right there. So, you know, that we definitely don't have a, a shortage of snuffs to review. So I'm going to try and fit in another one over the weekend. If I can't, I'm sorry. I'm at least going to try and get a behind the snuff out there. But I get back next Friday, so I'm going to try and do another review then. My brother might be visiting, so maybe I'll see if I can get him on camera too. But guys, thank you so much for coming back to my channel. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons down here next to my boobies. Leave those comments, and I will see you guys in a few days. Peace!